people are continuing to be athletic and, and continue into their 40s and 50s playing sports and so we, we're seeing tears. We're also seeing people damaging their knees because of obesity and, and, and arthritis. Hi, I'm Jonathan Roberts, Professor of Robotics. Here at QUT, we're developing robots to improve the health of people who undergo surgery. The problem we're trying to solve is that some orthopaedic surgery is difficult and intricate. We're developing intelligent surgical tools that can see and will make surgery safer. The impact of robotic surgery will be profound. I'm Dr Ross Crawford, I'm an orthopaedic surgeon and a professor at QUT. It will ultimately lead to tremendous savings in the healthcare system. It will allow us to treat conditions we treat now much better and more safely and it will ultimately lead to patients making more rapid recoveries. This is real world research addressing real world problems. Because at knee arthroscopy in particular is one of the most common procedures in Australia at the moment. We think that the, the heart of this problem is having robots to be able to see. Previous robots that are used in surgery really haven't had the power of sight and that's where we come in. What makes this sort of project really work at QUT is we have this diverse range of researchers and research staff and PhD students. We have engineers, we have the surgeons, we have the biologists, the chemists, the physicists, all working together. We're not aware of anybody else in the world actually using robotic vision for knee arthroscopy. Uh, there's no doubt that surgery is going to change in the next few decades. So. Uh, new surgeons training now will probably have to learn new ways of doing things. Ultimately the impact on the patient will be better outcomes, better, um, more affordable, more reproducible, um, more accessible healthcare. Robots will ultimately be better than humans in every field and surgery is the same. This is just another example of real world research here at QUT.